Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a, uh, another game that's free on Steam. And this one is called, uh, this one is called Doorways. This is an old prototype, and, and we're just gonna get into it, because it seems cool. Old prototype. This game you're about to play was created before the development of Doorways Prelude, the first episode in the Doorway series. The first one is both between late 2011 and early 2012. It was an early prototype made to show up the main feature of the game. Okay. I would turn on the sound, but it's like there's no options button apparently. Loading. Fascinating. The Abyss. Oh, well, that sounds cool. <coughs> Makes it sound like we're gonna die. Oh. Oh my God, we can run fast now. Who makes that sound when they jump? This guy is really out of shape. I think we're a man. I hope this is a man who sounds like this. The first level was called The Abyss. It was created by Tobias Rushjet, programming I'm butchering name in 2011 with a company named GD, GD Studios. They, they had the opportunity to make a quick prototype from scratch in two weeks. The setting looked like some kind of hell, and this was actually something you can see in the late, last episode from the official game Doorways, Holy Mountain of Flesh. Places. Wee yeah. Another medic. At the beginning of the game it was about action and platform without giving much support to the story, but focus on the atmosphere and gameplay. The goal is the goal for the project was to make something fun and interesting, but at the same time cheap to make. That's why the original idea was don't have any characters in the game since that made it more expensive to create. Alright. That's fair. Okay, so 
of the steps falling by themselves wasn't good enough, so you want to make fireballs. Alright. Too easy. Okay, that's a little more. Ah! My balls just got warped. Oof. Official game kept the idea of the twisted worlds and the ambience and the atmosphere of the most as the most important feature in the horror and flashbacks and elevations. The this flashback right here was actually made at the hospital in the doorways of the underworld. In the official release, the game features a little of action and platforming, but some other mechanics were added, like puzzles, characters, and inventory, and a refined story. That's interesting. Hold mouse, left click, or okay. Come with me, Block. Cool. I'm holding an object, use the mouse to push and attract it. Oh god, I just got cooked by fireball. I can't stop. I can't stop. I got it this time. Be a pancake. Ah, oh, balls! I was paying attention to not getting squashed. Are you gonna make things smash on that too? No, okay. Second. So I had a 
phone call, but I didn't know who it was, so I'll have to call him back later. <laughs> Boss! I need to just not jump like a terrified woman. Ah, Jack! Oh! Oh! A gate! A closed gate! Okay, well that's not cool. Should we check over the side? No. Are we done with the hell? Loading? Well, this is going great. We only died uh, a lot. The auditorium! Okay. Well, that sounds menacing. Ah, well, this doesn't look bad at all. I think hell might have been scary. The second part of the game was created by Tobias after leaving the studio to become an indie dev. That's why all the art visuals were here were place shoulders. But at the same time, the original day expanded to include creatures. And this time, this edition is influenced by Amnesia the Dark Distant. Okay. So there's their monsters now? <coughs> oh. Yeah, he's, he's, he's coming. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go this way if you don't mind. You do you. I'm a. I'm just gonna. Loser. As you can see, the scenarios and situations in the Rich game were a lot more twisted and severe than the ones from the final titles. That's why one of the first names for these earlier prototype was Twisted. Hey, dude, how you doing? Um, it seems okay. Um, oh, you can't see me, can you? Are you stupid? You must be stupid. I have an idea. Okay, come here, evil dude. Come here. Hello. How you doing? Come closer. Why? Are you scared? You're an evil man. He looks like he can tear my face open. Hello. Come to me. Okay. That's better. It's doing good, my friend. Okay. I don't know what just happened. I noticed. Did I die? Balls. I get it! I tried to jump over it. Ah, I did it! Ha! Ah, screw you and your floor marks! There are stories about a man who was trying to redeem himself. He was a lost soul running to escape from this... Okay, from the dark places. That's the reason for the game. They also get temporary names like the Path, the Atonement, and Hard to Finish work for blah blah blah. Okay. A long ominous bridge. Are we gonna have another creature follow us? Oh, this looks like a pile of. Jump in the way. 
Fall damage is the game in here, so I don't want to fuck. Found way. Uh, we're so far. I don't know where we're going, we're just kind of going places. always a key element in the series. It was respected from start to end. The gamers who have already played the games maybe have noticed that there aren't any text or icons during gameplay. The only text are on notes and loading screens on the main menu over the walls during the game, but never on over the screen interface. The goal was to get players sucked in the, by the game using the music and sound effects, but also with visuals and gameplay. Okay. Ah, another douche bro. Alright, um... <coughs> I'm gonna go this way. No, I can't go that way. Alright, you come to me. And... Oh! Okay! So you touch the flo- make it- make it follow you- that- Make it follows you? Alright. to work. Noob, get wrecked! Oh, no, no. I feel proud of my life now. Hey, how you doing? I guess I'm... Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. I didn't think this through. I didn't think this through. Oh no, no. Is 
this the end? Hmm, it's just telling about all the games, alright. I see the light! Oh, not done yet? <laughs> now we are. Well. If you guys enjoyed this, I guess, and have any other videos, games you want me to play, leave a like, or comment below, and leave a like and subscribe more. Thank you guys very much for watching, I will see you guys in the next episode.